forgot to grind coffee. Oh. So when we used to live in our New York apartment, we didn't have any sunlight at all. We had to put lights almost every time we are in the apartment, like doing anything because it was completely dark. And the first and major request for any apartment that we were looking at was the direct sunlight because I have had enough of not having any sunlight and now we are getting it as you see and I know it's a little too direct for filming currently and I'm sorry for like bad lighting but I do enjoy it I mean having sunlight in your apartment is everything like it definitely boosts your mood no matter if you are working from home as I do or not in Turkey we have even like a saying that oh my god it's hard <laughs> I didn't think it was so hard to uh, to translate but if sunlight doesn't enter your apartment the doctor will enter your apartment I do agree I know it sounds a little weird when you translate it right away from a different language but you got the idea I put some makeup on and I put some proper clothes on because I will film a reel for my Instagram account where I have this series of by series I mean I posted two reels on that topic but this is gonna be the third one I have this series let's call it where I share idioms or acronyms in English and by doing that I learn while doing my research and I get the chance to share the things that I learned with others. So feel free to follow me on Instagram, even if you're not interested in the idioms that I will share with you. Uh, I also do post like fashion kind of content and like lifestyle content there. So feel free to do that. I will film that really quick. And then my friend and I are going to a forest. It's like 15 minute drive, but at least you get the chance to walk around without a mask on your face because it's huge and there are not that many people who do go there in the middle of the week. I literally don't have any chance to walk around the city without a mask because it's really crowded and there are people all around. So having that opportunity to go for a forest walk or run or like whatever, it's just, it just means a lot. I'm just half asleep if you can tell you probably can it just hits me every single day at 4 ish p.m. I think it's because lately I haven't been sleeping well for some reason I've been waking up at least three or four times a night so that's why I'm not so rested in the morning and that's why I think I do kind of tend to fall asleep every single day during this time as I said it's Friday 4 p.m. and on every single weekend we're not allowed to go out so like we're on the lockdown so I need to get my groceries done because I barely have food in the fridge and on Monday my mom comes to visit me from Antalya to Istanbul because... Not because, well, there's no reason, I mean, just to visit me. I'm excited for that. On Wednesday, I posted a vlog on this channel and it was my first daily vlog for this channel. I do feel pretty good about that because my initial plan was to film a couple of days and then combine all the footage and make it a vlog. But then I realized that I have filmed a lot and it can be a separate vlog on itself. And the main reason that vlog makes me feel really good is because in that footage, I realized that barrier I had in my mind about me speaking English to a camera and that not being good enough for for some reason whatever kind of does fade away 
as long as I do practice if that makes sense I'm not sure if, if it does or not but yeah it's just something I had in my mind and it's just something that really kept me from doing that for months and months and months and as long as I do speak I just realized that it comes more naturally every single time I do practice. I recently read a phrase that says sometimes motivation does not come before you start doing something but it actually comes after you do start. So it just hit me because it works that way for me most of the time and I do feel motivated for this channel and for these vlogs but it's because I already started and I do feel and I do see that it goes better and better every single day. I just wanted to share my thoughts with you. But now I have to do laundry and go grocery shopping. Okay guys, so there's definitely something wrong with my sleep schedule because yesterday I thought that I didn't get my sleep properly so I was sleeping all day and I'm like, okay, let me go to bed pretty early today. And I did, I mean, I went to bed around 9.30, 10pm-ish, which isn't super early, but I was like, I'll get my sleep properly, I'll wake up pretty much early, like not too late. But, but not too late, I didn't mean that I will wake up at 4am, which I did today. And I tried to get back to sleep for a couple of hours. It's 6 a.m. now and I obviously couldn't get back to sleep. And now I'm like, do I get up or what What do I do? Like, what should I do? I mean, it's so dark outside. Maybe I just should get up now and take a nap during the day. That sounds good. So I just finished editing this vlog and I want to thank you for watching it. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.